Hey guys, so we're playing Alice Mayer now. Um, it's a spooky game, so we're just gonna jump right in. Uh, see if I can get this audio fixed up because it's kind of loud. The frog told me. Oh, the ant told me that the frog is bad. Why is the frog bad? The frog told me that the cat is bad. The cat told me, no, the rabbit is the worst of them all. So I... What'd you do? Did you kill a bunny? So that's roughly how life will be for you here. If you don't understand, there's a note in your room that explains it all again. Oh, goody tutorials. No one will ask anything of you here. There are a few things to keep to, but it should be a peaceful life. In addition, here. Oh, I got a notebook. Okay. Our own personal notebook. Use it however you like, for sad or for happy times. Just write down any feeling you have and give it to me, would you? Haha, <laughs> but some children just like to doodle in it, and that's fine by me too. Now there's still time before dinner you should greet the other children. Oh goody. Go leave and go straight left and find your rooms. They're all good children. It may not be immediate per se, but you'll get along, I'm sure. Ah, uh, myself just call me teacher. Look forward to having you here, Alan. Oh, we run kind of fast, okay. Way to bring up. I don't have any options for vi for audio and shit. Uh, I guess not. So we'll say we're gonna go up and see in slot five. That way we don't mess with the the other stuff. Oh, he said to go left, so. Uh, well, left and then what? Oh, okay, all the way left. Stella. I'll talk to Stella. That's odd, but you can really? Probably because you don't really feel like you're alive. Okay, then. Alan isn't, um, uh, That was a very meaningful conversation. Where is this little note? Do's and don'ts. Avoid leaving your room as much as possible except during free break. Okay. Don't take things from other rooms. Don't break anything to do to teacher. Don't force your way into locked rooms. And don't hit other people. Oh, it won't open. Okay, there we go. The game kind of froze for a second there. Oh, okay. Weird kids. Oh, I didn't get to see the name tag. Hang on. Joshua. Okay. Is that a map on the wall back there? Oh, Joshua's kind of cute. Uh, no, your name is Joshua, not Brown. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't remember what his name is. <sighs> no, it's not Helen. Oh my gosh, that's silliness. Oh, it's a design. I thought that looked kind of like a map. Okay, it's just the same thing. Oh, uh, it's got different drawings on the bottom. Oh, there's a lot of stuffed animals. <sighs> Excuse me. Um, Mount. Let's see. <laughs> nice to meet you. Okay, she just seemed a little awkward. Shy children's. Letty and Rick. And then I think this one's. Yeah, this one's our room. Alan. Oh. Well. Wow. 
Wow, I've seen, I've never seen you before. Oh, you're the one teacher mentioned. Call me Liddy. There's also Rick, but he's not here right now. He's a very nice boy. And you're Alan. I'd be really happy for you to play. Nice to know you. Well, that's kind of sweet. Okay, now what am I supposed to do? What is this? Oh, these are the toiletries. Oops, whoops. You can't go in the little girl's room. What's upstairs? The library? Yep. This is a door that I can't get into because it won't let me stand in front. Storage library space? Question mark? This lone room. That's kind of creepy. We can't call nobody. It's um, locked. I don't know. Well, I can just run up and down. There's another room back here. What the shit? Ha! It doesn't look like there's a fire in the fireplace, but okay. God, I forget what you're supposed to do now. Oh, here we go. How did it go? <laughs> yeah, some kind of conversation. Yay! And nothing horrible happened. That other kid, Ricky's still not there. Don't go to the second floor. What's on the second floor? <laughs> what are we in, like an orphanage or something? I don't remember. It's been a while since I did the playthrough without any audio on it. I might have to turn my fan off. Sorry. a lot of the audio. I'm sure you remember everything. Yeah, probably. Uh, <laughs> okay. What did he ask for? New books, yay. Why would we not? <laughs> uh, probably because he's a kid. Okay. Any particular reason why? Okay. We'll see. I guess we should save it here, too. Oh. The game froze. Now there's a boy here. See? Nice to meet you. No, this is the first time. We look rather similar, but I'm not Letty. Are you sure about that? My name's Rick and you're Ellen, right? She told me about you. When Letty goes to bed, I wash the room for her. Oh, well, maybe it's not quite that. Oh, well, nice to meet you. Yeah, you just, you have two beds, but I'm pretty sure it's the same person because there's no one in bed. Okay, uh, alrighty then. Hmm, 
You don't want to chit chat? I guess not. Um, how about no? Oh, did we? Oh, it's nighttime. Oh, shit. That is so creepy. No, it's not. I swear to God, if we hear any whispering or anything, I'm going to flip my shit. Slot. <gasps> oh. Uh, no. How about not? No, we're not. We want to go back to our room like teacher told us to. It's gonna break. Oh shit, it did break. Oh shit, oh god, we're caught. Oh shit, red headed. I'm sorry. That's creepy. <clears throat> now what? Ah! Uh, what the shit? What the f what the frick? Cat came out of freaking dresser or closet thing. I don't like the sound of that. Oh my god. <clears throat> what? Oh shit. Oh shit, you can't go out. Oh shit. Well then. Uh, oh god. Jesus, what the hey? <laughs> now, if this isn't a strange little human I've never seen before. You were the. F were you not just the cat that just let us in here? What the shit? What's that? Why, yes. If you say you're dreaming, Alice, then sure, this is a dream. Because here, what Alice says and does is everything. That's not your name? Oh, no, no. Alice is Alice. And that's because I say so. That contradicts what I said before. Maybe you're onto something, kid. This place is chock full of weirdos, so I'm just one of them. Me he he he. Oh, don't say that. You got don't stop in the middle of a good meal, do you? Same for dreams. Got to savor the taste. Oop. Well, I'm busier than I look. All right, I'll smell you. I don't know if I want you to smell me. That's kind of creepy. It won't open. Oh, I was able to go up. Uh, sigh. Oh, another visitor that makes six. Hmm, that doesn't add up. Oh, never mind. Good evening, Alice, and welcome. I'm the White Rabbit, the guide of these worlds. It's a rather big place, so call me if you need anything. Unfortunately, I can't move from this spot. It's a pain, it really is. Not to mention the pressing matter of the keys to the world door has gone missing. Four of five are simply gone, but I think I can hazard a guess as to who has them. And as previously stated, I cannot move an inch. So, Alice, I'd like to ask you two, how does it sound? Uh, can 
only save? No? Oh shit. Uh, okay, well. Luckily, I do have one of the world keys on hand, so you can already go in. Knowing who we're dealing with, I'm sure he scattered them all over the world. Once you find one, please bring it back to me. Don't be shy about asking any other questions you may have, but only this first time. I don't care to repeat myself again and again. The bunny has one ear ripped off. That was a disguise pain face just now, wasn't it? His hair is all messy. Oh well, I hope to have your assistance. Okay, well now we're going to, uh, we're going to save here. So that I can go and see what happens if we say no. Probably nothing, but, you know, can't be too careful. Messy, too messy. Uh, isn't this a note on the ground right here? No? Okay. Well, alrighty then. Wait, why are there little graves over here? <sighs> super creepy. Super, super creepy. Ah, oh, come on. And load. It takes a minute. This little scene is supposed to be spaced out. Not sure why the developer did it that way, but that's how it is. Oh, shit. Yo. You doing well for yourself? I'm feeling fine. Keys? Not me, no sir. That's the truth and nothing but. That's a lying ass face. Sure I did steal them, uh-huh. But that's only because someone else asked me to. Can't tell you nope, I may be a liar, but I won't lie to you, friend. Any other way to unlock them? No, no, of course not. Maybe if you told me your mom's maiden name or the name of your pet. Whoops, don't remember, huh? Besides, I'm just a guide. I'll give her hints. It's a trail. One key, world's key, leads to the next, one by one. Eh, what's that? I'm more or less a pain than that guy is. I'm no more or less of a pain. <sighs> Gotta speak properly. The white rabbit, I mean. Ugh, just saying his name ruffles my fur. He messed me up just as bad underneath this here hood. Want to take a look? It's a tad grotesque for a little one like you. Alright, time's up. See you later. Hey, and good luck. Is that blood? What the shit? One must not peer into the heart of man, for the heart is ever questioning. Up to, time, up to two times can be forgiven, but one cannot answer the third heart's third question. Will fall into an eternal slumber. Okay, this is the world's area. I guess, because you have one, two, five. Five doors. Wasn't there like six or seven kids? And the rabbit said there had been six visitors, but it was weird. I think that's a riddle of some kind, but I'm not sure. But we are going to save and end the video here and for watching, and I hope you'll stay tuned for what's going to happen to Alan next.